the energy of vibration reading the zodiac energy for the full moon reading for the um fire sign people <laughs> okay so um welcome this is a new series this is series is called um the zodiac energy vibration for the full moon now each and every month we're going to be having this um and you can um, receive this around the 15th of the month it's all about the full moon it's all about the energy that the full moon is going to bring in because um, of the energy vibration and the changing on the hurt I used to have this um, zodiac um, element readings for all the four elements but I've changed it I've stopped it and now um, they're asking me to bring it back okay so Thank you for being here thank you for being back all you fire sign people um it is the energy for the um aries leo sagittarius and obsolete so let's move in and let's cut your reading please like share these videos thumbs up and um let other people find these videos okay um the sun people or the people who were born um 12 a.m until 6 p.m. okay so if you were born 12 a.m. in the night between 12 a.m. and 6 p.m. you are a Sun sign for the moon people if you were born 6 p.m. till 12 a.m. at night you are a night person you're the moon person you were born when the moon is out and for the people the easiest thing to understand when were you born was the Sun down or the Sun was rising and that is your Sun and rising sign that sort of a thing okay so let's see um, what is going on for you fire sign people you fire sign people what's going on for the fire sign people um, we're beginning with the fire people you have the energy of Mars so the energy of Mars is all about your career okay Mars Mars has just come out of retrograde so it's all about your career so for you people who were born between the hours of 12 um, midnight and 4 and between 12 and 6 p.m. it's all about your career in this month okay all about your career let's see what else is coming up for the fire sign people moon sign people you have mercury so you're going to be working your magic you're going to be finding out if you're in a, if you are out of work or you're trying to build a financial stability in your life um, it's as if um, via the dream time because mercury is like whatever you touch is going to become gold whatever you touch is going to become gold so this is letting you know that some of you are going to be changing your career whatever you change your career to is going to be the right um, career move okay whatever you change your career to is going to be the right career move now Saturn I am one of those people who are so afraid of Saturn so you have three planetary aspects that you're dealing with you fire you fire um, sun sign people you're dealing with mercury which is career you're dealing you're dealing with Mars which is career and mercury which is you finding a way to bring magic in your life and not only that but what it's going to be doing is basically transferring and moving you to a positive a more positive um, situation and energy in your life okay so you have three planetary system let's see what the um, moon people have they have Pluto oh my god Pluto is coming to clear up relationship issues situation that no longer serves you um, Pluto is coming in um, to align you in the right energies okay so for the people who were born in the night whenever Pluto enter your sign you're going to be dealing with um, the scorpions okay because um, this is revealing secrets this is things coming out that you weren't aware of so you moon people it could be coming out in the dream time 
so be aligned and ready for that okay and it could have to do with career then we have the energy of Uranus oh my god you fire sign people are working with all these planets Uranus is coming in now Uranus is um, um, is a planet where it has to do with the, the air energies where the Aquarians are going to be coming in your life and they're going to be coming in and you know when you um, Pluto and Uranus is in a birth chart or working with certain people on a planetary aspect it is like moving out things that no longer serve and bringing back magic in your life or magic in a situations okay so you fire sign have gotten a lot of planet and the last energy is Scorpio okay so the last energy is Scorpio no Scorpio works with um, the energy of the scorpions work with the energy of Pluto so Pluto came out um, for unite people so um, you're gonna be dealing with a lot of Scorpio but when Pluto comes in your chart Pluto is like it is going to raise avoc you're going to be rare your secrets things that you were not aware of things that you were basically not aware of is going to be coming out unexpected things things that you had no idea about and Aries so you Aries oh my god you Aries um, are going to be helping out most of your fellow your fellow zodiac sign you're going to be helping out the Leo's the Sagittarians and the obsolete you fire people in this month of September are going to be feeling it because you are working with only planetary aspect the moon people the people who were born in the nights you're dealing with Pluto and Uranus now Pluto and Uranus coming in your life that means a lot of things is going to be removed out of your life if you're in a relationship with a Pisces or a Scorpio a Scorpio um, they're going to be moved out of your life okay um, a lot of you are going to be working with scorpions a lot of you are going to be working with scorpions Pluto rules the scorpions and um, Uranus is going to be moving these people out of your life for whatever the reason is it's as if um, they no longer serve a purpose in your life and it's going to be moving them out of your life now um, this could be um, where uh, Saturn Saturn is also ruled by the Capricorns okay so some of you could be connecting with a Capricorn that is going to be helping you to move a scorpion out of your life okay um, however way it could be that you met these two people for the Sun people Mars is here it's all about your career um, someone um, at work with your career study or whatever that is a Pisces that is a scorpion is going to be affecting you so be aware of this now there's an Aries that is standing um, here and you Aries are going to have to deal with this sort of a thing it's as if you're going to be the Aries people are going to be the balance for you Leo's um, Sagittarians and obsolete people is as if they are going to be um, being coming to your rescue for whatever that is transpiring now as your work whatever your whatever you are doing mercury and that sort of a thing in Uranus you're going to be seeing that whatever that is taken away from you whatever career is taken away from you um something good is going to be coming in 
okay because when Saturn is here Saturn is like you need to make some changes this is Saturn it's Capricorn it's a mountain gold it's that Saturn is putting you on the part where you need to start making some changes it's like it's pushing you out of your comfort zone okay so you fire sign people you got a lot to work with and this full moon energy this zodiac of the full moon energy for you guys you have a lot to work with because we're seeing it here comes up and it is such um, a powerful move because you guys are working with the planet the only um, person that is coming up or only other zodiac sign that is coming in to help you guys is the the, the scorpions and they can sting you remember you're a fire sign you can blow it or step on them but they can sting you because the Pisces the scorpions they're always coming up with this energy of you know um, bringing out things and um, it's as if the Capricorns are going to be standing and saying hey back up okay back up because this is not going to work okay you need to try another way and then it's as if the Aries are going to say no well thank you and the Aries is going to be bringing balance between these two people or these two situations so whoever comes in your life expect a lot of transformation in the lives of you fire sign people because it's all here where you're going to see a lot of transformation happening okay please like and share these videos and if you would like to see the rest of this full moon reading for you fire signs um, um, please um, click on the link down this video and it will take you to on demand and you will get a, um, an extension of this reading where we're going to be looking at the general energies um, for the um, the full moon and then we're going to be looking at love and then um, money okay so I'll see you at on demand let's move on I'm gonna see you guys at and